Hey, so welcome back. Uh, we're really excited about the progress of the build so far and how it's looking on our property. We're shooting to have this bathhouse completed by the end of September. Um, the project is moving fairly slowly for the following reasons. First off, I have no prior experience building anything like this. Uh, my dad is a builder, so I do have a basic understanding of the process and he's been available to answer some of my questions. So quick shout out to him. Thank you, Dad. But otherwise, I'm learning as I go. I'm watching a lot of YouTube videos myself and making some mistakes along the way, but uh, overall just learning and having fun. Secondly, I do graphic design work and of course have other obligations around the property and with life which limits the amount of time I can throw at this project. So I'm just getting out here in the yard when I can, and obviously it takes time to film and produce this content for YouTube. Um, it's actually nearly equal to the time it takes to build the build. So hopefully this project can be inspiring and helpful to others that want to save some money by doing the work yourself and take on a project that's fun and fulfilling.
So you just got through watching me install the underlayment paper and the drip flashing, and I really shouldn't have waited to install the corrugated metal panels. This is a couple days later. As luck would have it, we just had a big storm roll through um, with some significant rain and winds that damaged the felt paper. So it's nothing that can't be fixed. It's a bit of a setback, but I'm not going to show me tearing this all out and redoing it. Um, I was able to salvage the drip flashing, so I took that up, replaced the felt paper, put the flashing back, and moving on with the project. Um, you live and you learn, and I'll do better next time. Thank you.